Welcome back. So what do you guys think of our fishing excursion so far? It's pretty exciting stuff, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. This is the, the part where we're supposed to catch fish, but uh, so far, no luck. Uh, so tell me about the band, A Electrona. I was having trouble saying that. Electrona. And, and that is the Greek goddess of the sun? Yeah. yeah I never heard of her. Well, she was said to give men their morning glory. Oh. Probably someone I should get to know. Do you also do that? I mean, I'm just wondering where the name. Uh, <laughs> I mean, is she a hero? Is that something you uh, aspire to do? Uh, no. Just <laughs> no. <laughs> so, what can someone expect if they go to see one of your shows? Um. Is there anything crazy, or is it just straight music? Uh, nothing too crazy. No. No, no, no one's getting naked? No. Is there dancing? Is there any kind of like headbang and some dancing? No headbanging, but... It's been a while. <laughs> I'm from the 80s. I grew up with Motley Crue. Right? We used to bang our heads. No. no, it's more of like take the apple off the tree and place it on the shelf. Oh, oh, oh. see that again for me? So that's that dance? Take I can't off. let you know about all the deep, dark, goth, secret no. dance moves. Dying to know. I'm not privileged enough. <laughs> So I can call it out when I go to a club. All right, so where can people find your music? Uh, we have a MySpace page. Uh, if you just go on MySpace and search Electrona, then we should come up. How long did it take you to get into that top? Oh, five minutes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and four people. Yeah. yeah. All right, Chris, so we don't have any fish yet, but how, how are we going to know when one of them bites a line? You'll be able to tell once the, one is of the it, rods go off. Is it going to jump out? Uh, it all depends what kind of fish it is. If it's a salmon, so really bounce if it's a lake trout, to just tap it. So salmon, you're saying you caught a 30 pound salmon before. Yes. How long did that take to reel in? Hour and a half. Wow. Who, do you take turns? Uh, I had to give it to my dad because I was pretty young, but I didn't want to give up the rod. My arms were getting pretty tired, so I had to. And then he, he went at it for the rest of the time? Yes. So 30 pound fish, how big is this thing? Uh, he'd be like that, and then he'd be... Did you guys eat it? Well, yeah, it's on my wall, actually. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I stuffed them. That's a good one. Do you guys generally eat the fish you get? Yes. What's the best, trout? Uh, salmon. Salmon, yeah, I guess so. Bad question. Whenever I get a fish on the line, I kind of panic and, and reel it in. But is that what you want to do? Is there a technique to get uh, it? Just keep, your, keep tension on the fish at all times. Don't yeah. give them any slack, and you'll be fine. Yeah? So I always feel like i got to just constantly tug and tug. What you gotta do, basically? No, no, just keep pressure on the fish. That's all you have to do. What's the best time of year we want to fish? Uh, I like May, yeah. early June. This time of year is supposed to be good, but we're having tr troubles right now. Actually, the last two weeks have not been that good. And then, uh, does the time of day matter? Yes, uh, morning. Early morning is normally the best time, and late at night when the sun's just going down. Hopefully, we can get one. We'll see what happens. And how far down? We got these downriggers. How deep are these? Oh, uh, they're all over the place. I got two pretty close to the bottom, and I got the rest scattered to try to find the fish. And we have a sonar, right? Yes, we do. See fish down there. There's fish below us. There are fish below us. Hi. They're just not active right now. We can see like six or seven. You ever see like coming? There's like 80 on there. Yeah, you see them balled up in schools. Oh yeah. Yep. Wow. So is it usually like really hit or miss? Like you get none or you get a lot? Yeah. We both we basically average about four fish a trip. That's pretty good. We're going to bring the average down, I think. I think so, too. <laughs> well, folks, that's our show. Hope you enjoyed it. I want to thank Rick and Chris for taking us out. You can check out their website, ddfishing.on.ca. They charter boats seven days a week, all year long, out of Kincardine, Ontario. Also want to thank Buford Whitehead, Christina Patelos, and, of course, Electrona, our new favorite band. The girls are going to take us out with some music. Till next time, I'm Rob Cardinal. I'm Rob Cardo and welcome to King Carden. Joining us on this trip are the goth rock band Electrona. Why would it be Electrona? Do you watch fishing shows? No, but I reel money in when I'm doing my mime. Uh, okay, can I see that? Sure.
do. He took my fishing. He took my fishing in, Robert. Grateful little. First mate Chris will be taking us out on 28 feet of truck truck. Is that comfortable top? <laughs> Can you eat them raw? Like sushi, you know what I mean? You could, but I don't like that kind of stuff. I'd rather cook them. Women try and figure. They got my fish in here. 